That was one of my biggest complaints about Borderlands 2, is that you can't customize your defense in any way other than your abilities. And I guess your shield, but I mean... There are armor type. There, there is an armor type in the game, but you don't have any control over your armor in Borderlands 1, 2, or the pre sequel And I think if the, the cosmetics were tied to armor but could be unlocked as just cosmetics on top of your armor, that would have been a much better design. I'm always for that system, where I can make my gear, my defenses look like whatever. Do you have any quirks to a greatsword? Not really, just fast attacking and hard hitting. Just about done with this section. Oh, that's right, there is a... Uh, oh, get away. That's right, survival horror game. Don't go in for melee if you can avoid it. Huh? I want to pick up that. Thank you. Still no armor or rings. Yes, you do. You have All right. received a quest. I believe this is the quest that got me killed last time. Oh, no, 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 that's it. This is the one that I did first. I just have to remember to watch out for that thing that is basically doom. Alright. It's a trap. No. Oh. All right, all good here. Eleven potions, that's what I like to see. Welcome in, viewer. Let's just top off our health. Cross fingers, because permadeath is a bitch. Nice wand. I'll pass on that, thank you. Nothing. A lot of nothing. And to the right, one of these. Just fire our auto pistol uh, <laughs> of spell. Ghastly boots. Oh, did that set me on fire? Come on. Oh, these are identical to what I'm wearing. Great. Uh, no, I'll pass on that. Oh, great axe. She's got a great axe. Look at her. Right, treasure second, treasure second. No more of the greedy fingers. Hey, some shoulder armor. And again, everything I put on looks good.
It's amazing how I can offer myself advice that it will immediately not take. I say, hey, idiot, don't charge in because you'll get your ass kicked and you're gonna churn through your health potions. And then I immediately do that. Alright, that's very good. Now is, yeah, now is the same time. I don't have to rush for the treasure, it's not gonna fade away. Alright. Stay the course with upgrading the magma sphere. Sphere? Yeah, sphere, and see if we can get that to a useful point sooner rather than later. Uh. Yeah, here we go. I'm actually finding that I don't like going for the two-handed weapons as much. The execute chance is just a really nice bonus where if I have to use melee, it's going to be much more effective. That's a fight. I guess... Ouch, that guy hits hard. The only thing I really don't like about have this particular playstyle is it requires me to move around a lot with point-and-click movement. And if I have to move around a lot in a game where the combat is important, I'd much rather have just direct one-to-one -one control as opposed to the, you know, sort of attack, dodge, attack, dodge, attack, dodge. Oh, I didn't want to open that just yet. Again, not heeding my own advice. Just wait for everything to be dead before you try and pick up the loot. It's not going anywhere. I think Nuclear Throne has brainwashed me into constantly doing that. Wait, is that a... There is a secret room in here! Oh my god. I was convinced that there was not a secret room in this dungeon. Alright, just look for the sparkly brick, I guess. Um, hmm. Yeah, I'd rather take more armor over two points of health. Let's go back to this. Oh, that's it, right. That's a two-handed. Doesn't even matter. Okay. So I guess now I'm on the lookout for twinkly bricks. We have to get those status effects on them. So that they take damage over time on their way to us. I didn't miss any other sprink sprinkly? Twinkly bricks, did I? No, not in any of these rooms. I can't believe I've been missing the this entire time. Take some that regenerates my mana. Especially in an ambush point, oh my god. What an excellent time to get this benefit. That skeleton is in a wall. That's cheating.
Uh, dodged. Okay. I'm wondering if I should just change the music to. Oh, fuck. Change the music to You Can't Bring Me Down by Suicidal Tendencies. That would get me pretty pumped for a hardcore mode. But I don't think anyone wants to hear that play on loop. Anyone but me, anyways. I will identify these pants. Sure. What is this? Strength and physical armor. Yes, please. With this shoulder piece, I look like McCree. Like, just for some reason, I think of McCree. And I really don't want to keep thinking about McCree because he makes me angry. Oh, fuck. Nice. That's a twinkly brick. I knew there couldn't just be one. I don't think that's what a truncheon is, mate. <laughs> Regardlessly, this is better than what I've got right now. Alright. I'm sitting on health po nine potions, I'll be fine. Though now I'm really wondering if I... Yeah, I actually did forget a section. May as well go back. He has posted for more twinkly bricks. and breaches. You are worse. Yes, please. And now I look like a warlord. War lady. I absolutely have to check to see if I missed a brick. <laughs> 